Hey, Olaf, it's good to see you again. Jose, always a pleasure. Our man. second always, interview. I know, yeah, I know. I'm still, I'm still, and you still relevant wanna... to the conventions? Yes, and you still want to talk to me. That's amazing. <laughs> I find that great. So We had a great interview in uh, Chicago. Yes, we did. Now we're in Orlando. We're so, in Orlando. Uh, you know, so, sadly enough, you've been killed off yes. of The Walking Dead. Yeah. Uh, so what, what, what's been going on with you since you were off... The show, Off well, the show. Uh, I left uh, Walking Dead and I, I did a movie called Solace. Mm -hmm. It's uh, due out this year with and Sir Anthony Hopkins and uh, Colin Farrell. And then I got on a plane and I flew even further. So I went from L.A. to Atlanta. Then Atlanta, I went on to South Africa and I did the movie Chappie. Oh, yeah. That was Have a good You guys movie. caught Chappie. I yes. caught Chappie. Right. It was good. Very good uh, movie. With Neil, the Neil Blomkamp uh, third installment to his, uh, I think, incredible body of work. Uh -huh. um, the sci-fi uh, the, the, the sci-fi sci action film with the very friendly, daring, but sympathetic uh, robot. Mm-hmm. Um, so it was a fantastic movie that came out in March, and now it's on DVD, Blu-ray, like, last week. In the meantime, on the weekends, I've been having a passion project that ended up becoming a full-time project, and I made a game. Oh, you it's did? It's a card game. A card game. Called Free Me the Game, which you see on posters everywhere. Uh, 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 here it is. Little card, Free Me, yes. And what Free Me the card game is supposed to do is supposed to encourage real human interaction. No, well, now that's Free Me is like, but... We can't have real human interaction <laughs> Why if you can't if you can't go like this to talk to people. <laughs> well, know. that's virtual interaction, yeah. right? So it's it's it's. I mean, that's like a, it's like taking a, a fax machine, right? It's a copy of you. It's uh. not the real you. So like, if you guys are in a, in a restaurant and, and you look around, and you after you order that that time in between, everybody looks down on their phone. Oh, right. Doing, so now you pull out "Free Me the Game," uh -huh. and you take your phones first of all, and you put them face down on the table. Ah, okay. And if you ever get caught peeking at it, then you draw an extra black card. Okay. Right? And we'll get into what those are in a minute. So the way Free Me the Game works is you have these fantastic blunders, embarrassing uh, moments that people, for whatever reason, have been posting of themselves online. And we've collected them and put them in the box. For example, uh -huh. this young lady tried to be cool and hip and do this cute selfie, but she forgot that there was a mirror behind her. <laughs> and voila... She's, She's on the toilet. On the toilet. <laughs> so that's going to lose her a certain amount of friends and followers. There's a post and a hashtag. And so it's almost like set up punchline. And the whole thing embodies it for really a standalone, almost satirical piece. Uh -huh. Or this young man who accidentally liked his sister's bikini pic. <laughs> hashtag family comes first. So there's a snarky element to these. We've collected our favorite blunders that we found inspired online. Thank you. They, they, well, they love it. They think it is good. They can't wait to get a copy. They're all taking home a copy. If you look under your chairs, you've got one. <laughs> no, it's not like Alan. I'm kidding. So you play the card game moment to moment uh -huh. so that you're interacting with everybody around you and right. you have to come up with funny hashtags to make the other person laugh. And you know, you, like, you know your wife well. Yeah. So it's like, I know if I make a comment about this, it's going to make her laugh. Yeah. So it's very in the moment, and if you're quick-witted and you have good hand-eye coordination, you can slap a slap chat card first, uh -huh. and you're going to win the game. If you win the game and you make other people laugh, you don't have to do this, but the loser does. It's a black card. The black card is a social media dare, something that you have to post to your actual social media, <laughs> which is fun. So now there's a card game that makes you laugh that has real world stakes. Uh -huh. So... You can be very daring and do my favorite, uh, which is you have to fill in something which we call smingo, smingo social media bingo. So you, I'm going to give you, say, a letter and a number, A6. So you go into your contacts and you go to the sixth contact entry below the letter A, and you find... All right, he's going to uh, do this. We're, we're, we're going to play along. We're going to play this, along. I like it. See what this does. Contacts. Black card challenge. Uh, okay. Here it comes. One, two, three, four, five, six. All righty. So who is it? That's Adrian from uh, this like Walker Stalker. Yeah, she's a friend that I met in Con. The, 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 at the first Atlanta Walker Stalker. All right. So you're going to say Adrian. Okay. Or Adriana. Adriana. A Adrian. Adri yeah. Adrian, you're going to say one of these things to Adrian, and you're going to do a self like video post uh -huh. and put it online and you say hey and you read let's say you read hey, this one you should definitely wear tighter I, I'll go for that one it's like where, okay so how do we oh, do are you going to do it All right, I'm so gonna go do to it. your camera go to my camera okay uh, flip it around okay go video it's like video alright and click 
record. And then read that and fill in her. Hey, Adrian, you should definitely wear tighter pants. <laughs> okay, fantastic. Uh oh. Did you, all right, get done recording. So now you post that uh -huh. and you tag her in the video. Okay. And then she's going to be like, what the heck? And so before she goes on, she'll see hashtag black card challenge uh -huh. or free me the game. Uh -huh. Right? And so then, then she's like, why did Olaf think I should wear tighter pants? And come to think of it, a lot of people have been telling me I need to wear tighter okay. pants. And they're all citing free me the game as the... Um, uh, as the instigator of why people are making this fashion recommendation. So their curiosity serves them. They go to freemethegame.com and they will find our Kickstarter campaign. And so we've uh, put this game on Kickstarter so that we can get this game out there and make it a reality without having to go through the typical source that will probably make us change the game. Not as fun, right. who knows what. So go to Kickstarter or go to freemethegame.com. You go to Kickstarter and you can back the game for only $17 plus shipping, you can have all of this. Or awesome. for 30, you can actually get this with a blunder card for, that I'm in and I'll sign it and awesome. put it in. What do you think? I think that's great. Yeah. I think it's great. I was like, I've got my, I was like, I'm wait, waiting for mine to show up, so that'd be good. You better post that. Yes. You better post that video so that I can see it and I'll retweet it and the whole thing. Okay. And then, I'll then, do and that. then let's see what this person says to you in response. <laughs> all right. Great enough. Think that's yeah, she will think it's fine. Yeah, she, that was a per sport. perfect one. It's like to pick. Uh -huh. It's like she she's a good friend. We better play. <laughs> we better play one. again than next time. <laughs> All, right. All right. Well, thank you, Olaf. It has been a pleasure, been like a always. Pleasure. And always. well, we'll see you in Atlanta. We'll see you in Atlanta. Awesome. Bye now. Goodbye. <laughs>